This is another case, and I call the the Lego Minecraft Mountain Base. This is a bit big. It looks a bit big. Very nice, and can be attached with multiple parts. If you saw my old other video showing what I was going to do today, then you would have noticed that part too, which is in the background. That part is coming in later for you. But for now, we're just going to review the main part of it, which is your mountain base. Basically, it has a shovel, the Steve, actually two Steves, just in case you want to play around. I mean, there's a pickaxe too, which comes out, well, two pickaxes, but I mean, in case you want to play around with the first one, so he can hold his shovel going digging, or just stand in the lava, something like that. But let's turn it around. You see, there's a small little window right there, which shows the inside of it. Now, the support's a bit bad because it can connect, so it's gonna be. I'll just place that right there for now. So anyway, this top can come off. Let me put this thing on my uh, little stand here. There we go. That comes off for easier play. And then, set this back down. And maybe lift it up. So, for example, this has little two iron blocks on it. And it's just basically a small little set. Now we can take it off one more time to show the final peak of the mountain. Which is just this little small area that comes with a block of coal, a stone block, another block of coal, another stone block, redstone for some reason, TNT, and then two gold blocks right here. Well, gold ore, but I mean, it's, it's mine, yeah. Anyway, you can set these in however positions you'd like, but I have mine like this. And then there's a torch there to claim that that's deep. Now, I will do a smaller view on another part of this. There are tons of parts for this. This is just one of them. I have to disassemble the other part, which will be reviewed in the next part if I get... I will review it later. For now, let's attach this. Like it's, and once it's attached, I have to uh, on a piece to make sure that it does not fall apart. And normally, I would normally I would probably just review this itself, but we're gonna turn it around. You can see that there is a secret little block right there. It is a diamond block or diamond ore block, whatever you'd like to call it. There's a creeper right here next to the water. And you see, I do include these little dots right here. So in case you want to use your bucket, use the buckets on them, which I will sew in the little, another part of it. But for now, you have a little tree from the mine set. This is that entire part from the mine right there. Then we have a little waterfall with a bridge going over, so you can get to your next part, which will... Well, you need another part for it, but I'm not going to exactly do that, because I don't really want it to, and so, yes, and I'm not going to do a huge tutorial on this, as this took me like three hours to assemble and find, figure out, but now we're going to move on to this part, and since I've lost most of my parts in my minecart, I just had to craft a new one. Anyway, and I lost, I didn't have enough parts to make on that. I didn't have enough thing or like parts to create an actual furnace, so this is just me building another furnace without any like flames under it or anything like that. So, for example, we have a rail down there. Turn right there. We have another rail and a ladder, which we'll get to in a moment. And this turns around. Put a little stop right there, which you, which your Steve will stop. And then you come down here, which it tends to your little um, base. Mountain base. Let's look. Oh, 
features that this this all has. First, you can take off the ladders. So, for if you wanted to, like, Steve has to craft the ladders first, you could just do that before he places them. This chest is not open because I didn't. But there's a bread chest, there's two. This chest has a lava bucket in it and a water bucket. And then these, this chest has two pickaxes for you two Steves to mine together. Now we're going to move on to the next floor, which is basically not detachable, because I forgot to make it detachable, but anyway, the next floor is a small little lookout, because I'm a little pain right there, and yes. And then another ladder on this floor to make sure that it stay there. We are going to our final the final parts of it, which is detachable, which is this ta the the archer tower. This small little part of it makes sure that you can get to snipe the enemies. Let's say a skeleton's coming, you could snipe him from right here and stop the skeleton before he reaches your base or attack find sees you. And obviously, like most other mostly like other sets the rail does not does work itself so that's a great feature there and that is it for this little minecraft so, and as i said before these all three go together as one huge set which is nice and there's my other what I will use and yes that is it for now and bye porkians